Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be talking to you about obviously the new year and my goals roughly for this year. Not really that I've got any goals, but we're just going to work with what I'm saying. Um, so with it being a new year, um, and obviously Cartier's first birthday is coming up, I'm going to um, hopefully try and do like a... Um, a birthday party thing for her so we're having a cake smash that she's gonna have uh, at the beginning of February and then she is gonna have like on her actual birthday or maybe I don't know I can't remember if her birthday is actually on the weekend or not um so like if it's not on the weekend it'll be like the weekend either before or after her birthday um, or hopefully have like a little birthday get together thing uh, and hopefully a few mamas will come over with their little ones and yeah just something small not too big um, I've just passed my theory from my driving so I'm hoping to start lessons in February as well and then pass my test hopefully quite soon um, and then obviously get myself a car and I'll be able to travel wherever. Um, and then for the house itself, I'm hoping to, for this room, get rid of that bedside table and get two white ones for either side. I'm hoping to get rid of the wardrobe that's there um, and then put drawers along there. Um, Cause I think that'll look quite nice. I'm hoping to get a new TV for this room and the lounge. So this room has a TV, um, which was in the lounge at first, but because I haven't exactly had enough money to get a TV for every room, I'm going to give Cartier this TV when I've got another TV and then she can watch TV in her bedroom. But move it like carry on on with this room. Um, so behind me, I'm going to get some fairy lights going down. There's going to be some fake ivy going down and then hopefully as long as I've got room and um, some like flowers going down along it so it'll look really pretty uh, I don't know if I'm gonna put wallpaper or paint on the wall I might just leave it as it is but if I do put paint on the wall it'll probably be like a light grey um, maybe a black even uh, I don't know I'm not too sure but it'll either be like a light grey or a black so it might even be black wallpaper because I know that black paint is really hard to do. Um, but I'm not really interested in doing much to this flat because I am hoping to move into a home soon, like an actual house. So I don't really want to do much here. What you are leaning on top of at the moment is a set of drawers. Um, these are Cartier's drawers. But I will be getting rid of these as well and then she will have um, a set of white drawers like I'm going to have so then she's got her own little drawers and she's going to have a wardrobe as well and I'm going to get her a divan bed also I don't know if I'm going to get her a single or a double yet I might get her a double so then she's got more room to roll around um, but then I might get her a single and yeah, I don't know. But either way, because she is still quite little, she'll have like the side barricade things. So then hopefully it'll stop her from falling out of the bed, which I think will be really good. But I do think that having a big bed for her will be really good for her. And then obviously I'm hoping to get this TV that's in this room on the wall in front of her bed so then obviously she's got TV as well to relax with um, and then obviously I'm going to get her a nice toy box with her name on it um, like personalised and everything and that's going to be all for like her toys and everything in one area uh, again with her bed she will also have bedside tables so her room is going to be really really pretty 
Um, for the lounge, I'm hoping to, like I said, get a TV in there that will also be on top of the wall, like on the wall, and that'll be above the fireplace because I think that'll look really nice. Um, like a nice little home area. I think that'll look really, really pretty. Uh, and then I can't remember what else I'm doing. Apart from like painting and pictures and whatnot. Um, that need to go up uh, getting a blind um, for the room and then I'm going to get some curtains as well after I've got a curtain pole that fits um, and then do that up really nicely her room will also have blind and curtains and so will my room the kitchen that's going to have a blind and that's just going to be it um, the front door that's going to have a curtain going along it uh, when obviously I can get the curtain pole up because I've got the curtain pole ready for the front door it just needs putting it up but at the moment because I've not had any experience of putting holes and screws into a wall I don't know what I'm doing and I'm finding it rather difficult so until I've mastered how to do that I can't put it up and everyone that I've asked for help at the moment is busy so we're just gonna take it slow and see where it goes um, like I said, I am hoping to move into a house so then I can just sort everything out properly. Um, in my new property, if there is no floor down, which I really doubt there will be, I don't think I'll be lucky like I have been in this place, um, at least I'll be able to, um, what's it called? put floor down um i'll just use the company that i use for the carpet in this place and every so often i'll um i'll sort out in the room with floor and we'll just like slowly sort that out uh the kitchen i don't know if i'm gonna have a kitchen that's gonna be big enough like but we'll just see how it goes um with the kitchen obviously there's like a little pantry thing in there and then there's obviously my massive table so that's quite nice it's quite a nice little area for when you're having dinner and you've got guests around and whatnot the porch area i want to um not really expand it but like clear everything out give it a deep clean and then obviously like in there is the fridge and the freezer so just really keep everything in there but just make it more spacious if possible um and for the kitchen obviously i want to get everything pink uh like a new microwave a new kettle and a new toaster which obviously i'm hoping to do they'll be pink i'm gonna get pink placemats um i've got some coasters but they're like silver and they're glittery uh pink cutlery if possible not that i need any more cutlery but pink ones would go very well with my kitchen just saying i have brought myself an oven that is brand new so don't need to worry about that now um i want a lampshade for this room uh i don't know what color i'm gonna get it might be like a black because for bedrooms i do like having black blinds and black curtains so i will probably have a black lampshade if i can get one um and then obviously either side of my nice white bedside tables will be some really nice black bedside table lamps which i think would look really cute as well and very aesthetically pleasing um for the bathroom I want to get a sink cupboard thing and I've already got one basket in there um, which I put all like the shampoos and conditioners and whatever else in but I'm hoping to get a few more of them for when I've got my sink cupboard thing and then I can put them in there so then I've got a basket, Cartier's got a basket and then there's a basket for obviously women products and then I don't know if I'm gonna have guests or like whatever but there can be another basket in there, like a spare. Um, I'm not really interested in too much else. I have two fridges and technically two freezers. I just don't use one of the freezers. So 
the small fridge and the small freezer I'm going to get rid of and in replace of the what's it called the small fridge I'm going to hopefully change the fridge for hopefully a tumble dryer so then I can just whip out the clothes from the washing machine to the tumble dryer and done I don't have to worry about messing around drying clothes like outside or in the house and on the radiators and whatever uh the bedroom as well i will get like another wardrobe don't know where i'm gonna put that it might be over there but i'm gonna get two wardrobes um i think that would be a lot better but definitely two drawers two wardrobes i think that would be probably the best thing to do but i don't know i'll just i'll see i'll have to like decide when i can be bothered i ain't got a clue um and then outside i really want to like because it's a shared garden it's difficult for how i can do everything but if i was to stay here i would definitely put up a fence um and then obviously for my half i would probably put like tables and chairs and probably like a little play area for cartier but because i don't intend to live here for very long um I'm not going to do anything for the garden but I do intend on getting one of them washing things that rotate so then I can put more clothes out on the line when obviously it's a nice day. Uh, for Cartier's bedroom I'm hoping to obviously make it more of a big girl bedroom but I'm also wanting to keep it obviously child age um so i'm hoping to get like a really nice ball pool for her and a nice little rug um and probably one of them lights like projector light things um and then i'm hoping as well which uh, i forgot to mention the cot that obviously is the moon that she's had since she was born um Oh my god, I can't actually believe I've had this over a year. Um, anyway, the cot, the moon-shaped cot that she had when obviously she was born, I still have that, I haven't got rid of it. So I'm gonna put that in her bedroom and above that I'm gonna have um, shelves of books and on top it's gonna say read um, or reading area or something like that. And that can just be like a little seat for her when she wants to read a book or whatnot and then probably in front of it is going to be the toy box uh, I can't think of anything else to be honest but that is roughly what I want to do for the house for my driving I've obviously like I said I want to pass my test now that I've passed my theory so I need to get on with my uh, lessons rather quickly pass my test and then obviously I can then look for cars I'm hoping to get it on a finance well I'm not I'm hoping to buy it outright but I don't think I'll be able to do so so I do intend on getting it on a finance um, to find out what car I want that's a different story um, apparently the top best three cars for your first time having a car after you pass is a fo focus um a fiesta and i can't remember the last one i think it was um a corsa a voxel not too sure though but yeah they're the top three but i'm not sure if i will go for one of them i'll possibly if i do it'll probably be the focus anyway um so i'm hoping to sort that out and then the interior of that is going to be pink of course and then when i've got enough money i'm going to wrap whatever car i have i'm going to wrap that pink um as well and hopefully if possible i'm gonna get pink tires because you know a pink car can't be complete without pink tires anyway i think i've got a pink obsession just saying um but yeah hopefully obviously i'll be driving uh i'll be working as well and then I'll, after i start work i'll be saving money and i do intend in the next nine years because i'm hoping to buy a house by the time i'm at least 30 um i will be buying a house hopefully and hopefully i can buy a couple of houses and rent 
them out and then when I find a house that I think is suitable for me, I will buy that one and settle in that one. But for now, I'm just gonna live in a council property, save my money and then try and like expand and buy a few houses and then find the right one for me. But I'm not too sure, we're just gonna see how it goes because I might just find the perfect one for me straight away. But I do intend to buy like a house that's pretty much run down. Um, and then I can just do it all up from the beginning, like proper fresh start, fresh canvas, everything. Um, quite big as well, so then I can either remove walls or add walls or expand it if possible. Something with like a nice biggish garden, um, obviously enough room for Cartier, but then enough room for myself with what I want to do. Um, and then obviously, like I proper want a nice home and obviously I'll insert pictures of what I mean for what I want to do to my own home. Um, but yeah, just something roughly like that. Um, but obviously I, I do intend on working quite, quite a lot and saving as much as I can because I think that's just going to be the best thing for me, especially because I want to buy a house. Um, but I do think that right now I'm just going to start off small and build up slowly and anything that I own money to or like debts if you want to call it that um, are paid off and completely done with. Um, I don't intend on getting another phone, like I've got paid two years for this phone but I don't intend on getting another phone anytime soon. Um, I do intend on once this contract is over like just paying for my sim i think it is and that's it like not getting another phone until like just keep saving because i know i've realized that i'm spending more money than i actually have and it's not good although i'm never in debt i am spending more money than i've got so i really want to switch that around and save money instead of spend it and then when i've got my own place probably spend again but like more on the saving side I didn't say anything about Christmas, like what I'm hoping to do for obviously Christmas this year. So I'm hoping that now I've got two pink Christmas trees. Again, we're going on the theme of pink. Um, I'm hoping to get some more decorations from the pink tree, the bigger one, uh, some baubles and maybe possibly tinsel for the smaller one uh, and lights for that tree as well. Um, because my big tree has lights and baubles on it already which I'll insert here um then I'm hoping to get like this garland hopefully that's going to be pink or at least it's going to have pink features I'm going to get a Christmas wreath that's going to be pink um hopefully I'm going to get some decorations for the window so then that's going to be quite nice as well no they won't be pink but Christmas decorations for the windows um I'm gonna get one of these tree skirts. I'm gonna get some stockings for me and Cartier. They will be pink. Um, and anything else for Christmas, I'm gonna insert here as well. Uh, so yeah. Um, that's it for this video. I hope you liked it. Uh, there will be a few more videos coming out soon and I will see you in my next one. Bye.